Hello, families. Welcome back to the American Family Survival Network. I'm your host, Jeffrey Snipes. Why Americans Feel Poor. This comes to us from ZeroHedge.com. Why do so many Americans feel dissatisfied about the economic state of their nation? None other than former Fed Uber Dove, Narian Kocher Lakota, Fiction Petals. One simple chart that can make it hard for any card-carrying Democrat to argue with. As Bloomberg reports, the chart below shows the cumulative growth in per capita real GDP in the U.S. over the preceding 10 years. For each year from 1957 to 2015, it does a great job of depicting the country's post-World War II macroeconomic experience. Noronia sees three key points. Growth was unusually strong in the 1960s and 1970s. In every year from 1966 through 1973, per capita income was up between 30% and 40% from a decade earlier. Thus, it's not surprising that many Americans recall this as a great period for the nation's economy. In every year from 1984 to 2007, a period that economists call the Great Moderation, because of the way both growth and interest rates stabilized, per person income was up between 20 and 30 percent from a decade earlier. That's ample reason for Americans to view this as a good period for the economy. Cumulative per person growth from 2005 to 2015 was lower than in any prior decade in the sample. That certainly helps explain why many Americans are unhappy with the nation's re recent economic performance. As he concludes, Americans are right to want better performance than they've seen in the past 10 years. So this is the chart. This is uh, a history of prosperity, percent changes in real U.S. GDP per capita from a decade earlier. And here is 1957, down, up, down, up to 1967, where it goes up. And it kind of comes down a little bit, more down here. It goes up a little bit in the 80s, 87. And then it kind of stays the same in 97. And then it drops dramatically in 2007. And then it goes up just a little bit, and then it starts to come back down. And here we are in 2015. And which is even pretty much even with 2007. So, folks, what this means is that you need to be prepared for any and all situations. So, please remember to go to the American Family Survival Store.com for all your family's emergency and survival needs, uh, for your emergency water, for your emergency water containers, uh, for your storable food, uh, for ammo through our premier affiliate, SD Bullion. Uh, through information on how to have a concealed carry and be a responsible gun owner through our premier affiliate, the USCCA. And please, folks, remember to always protect and safeguard your family. Fear not, and God bless. Thank you so much. Have a great day.